HVAC breaking news of the day. What's causing the R454B shortage? When will it end? And what can contractors do today to get some? Let's get into it. Okay, so what's causing the shortage? The shortage comes down to three key factors. Number one, an industry-wide rush to R454B. Since most manufacturers choose R454B as their primary low GWP replacement for 410A because of the similar pressures, similar properties, and minimal design changes, it created a massive all-at-once demand. Instead of the market splitting between different refrigerants, the majority of OEMs went with 454B. This created a compressed, concentrated demand spike not just for the refrigerant itself, but also for all the components and equipment that use it. As Clifton Beck reported to ACHR News, this isn't just a supply problem, it's very much a demand issue that caught the entire supply chain off guard. Number two, cylinder supply constraints. R454B requires new, specially rated A2L refrigerant cylinders that meet updated safety standards. The manufacturing capacity for these cylinders wasn't fully scaled when the demand exploded. So even if refrigerant production was ready, there simply wasn't enough cylinders available to move the product. Number three, panic, buying, and hoarding. As soon as the industry realized supply was tight, distributors and contractors understandably started hoarding, buying double, triple what they normally would use just to play it safe. It's certainly understandable. But it made the shortage spiral even faster, driving availability down and prices up. Okay, so when will this end? Manufacturers are saying supply should start improving by late 2025. More cylinders are now in production and refrigerant manufacturing is ramping up. But realistically, it's going to stay tight through the summer and likely into early fall. So what can contractors do right now? Here's a couple tips. Order the refrigerant early. Work with multiple distributors, check pre-charged units. Many manufacturers have increased factory refrigerant charge to cover longer line lengths, which may reduce how much extra refrigerant you need at the site. That's your breaking news of the day. Thank you for watching. If you're dealing with this shortage, please drop something in the comment. Are you finding R54B in your area or not?